Hiya, my name's Geraldine McAleese and welcome to my Halloween costume and makeup tutorial. <coughs> so basically today I'm going to do um, a full a full kind of Halloween makeover for anyone who wants to kind of go for the, the kind of sexy Halloween image this year, okay? So if you notice, I kind of have like a few spots and stuff on my face. So I think like what I recommend first is um, like 8 year old pseudo cream. Um, I think, I think it's actually gone off since the 2nd of February 2016, but apparently that's the best. So you use that as like your concealer. So you just, um, you just kind of dab it in and you just give it a, you know, um, and then you just rub it in and then that kind of like helps reduce the redness around the spots and, and that as well. So um, next up I'm going to use CN Face Cream from from Lidl and um, basically that's gonna like be like my primer so you you just threw in a, a nice generous blob of that and you you rub that all into the face first of all as a kind of a base do you know what I mean because you have to make sure that um that the makeup stays on well do you know what I mean so Right, so um, next up now you gotta use um, your pan stick and I like to use the cool um, cool copper shade because I like the kind of darker look. I like to look um, a bit more exotic. Um, so you, um, you just put it on everywhere I suppose and you just do it down the nose and on the, the spots there, do you know? And you just pour yeah, that in like that. And um, you use brush. Um, you get these anywhere now, like pennies or wherever. And, and you just rub all that in, all in around the face there, do you know? You can, you know, structure your face. Um, accordingly, and you can you can push it down then um, onto the neck later with a brush. So what I like to do then is is top it up with this um, Maybelline um, mousse, um, Dream Mousse Bronzer it's called, and I got the golden hail colour there as well. So I just kind of stick the brush in um, into into it. So um, do you know? So um, so you you just brush that on to the kind of cheekbones, um, and that gives your cheekbones a lift. Do you know? Because you kind of want to just have the tan kind of uh, coming out there and you put down the nose um, for this and along the chin alright so that's that one topped up there now and um, finally just kind of put on some more bronzer um, because everyone like kind of likes to like be really really tanned so you just put it in, you scoop it around and you, you suck in to find where your cheekbones are. Right along the edge there. Alright. And you can really, you can really now bring out the um, the cheekbones and the um, you can re you can really um, Bring out the chin, the chin bone. Then there as well for that. So so far, you can see the kind of features that you would augment um, on your entire um, face. So next up now, what I'm going to do is um, use this um, no brand. Um, 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 
eyelash and um, eyebrow uh, designer, design, designer. Um, so it has two, it has two ends there if you see. So it has that little brush end and it has the kind of like kind of other brush end as well. So you just take that and that kind of like, you know, you can just push your eyebrows kind of into shape like that. And then you use the other end for your eyelashes just to kind of, you know, give them a comb. Like, you know, comb the eyelashes out like this. Next up, now, I'm going to do the, eye, the eyeliner. So I'm using the, the silver, the silver glitter range from, from um, H&M. Just to give, you know, you want to have that kind of sexy kind of look for for the for Halloween and like I kind of like to use it as like an eyeshadow as well because it kind of just lifts the eye so you go over the lid of the eye like that see look see what I mean it just pops pops right out um, you flick you just you can give it a flick to do your you know you like to like lift the eye out with the flick uh, like that so, you know, you can instantly see now, you can, you know, you can see it really lifts out the eye. Oh look, there's a bit there now. So any spraggly bits, just, just, just fill them under the eyelid. Just fully kind of bring out the eyes. Do you know what I mean? You can see how brown, how brown my eyes are there now, you know what I mean? So next up now, I'm going to use the um, Lash Mascara by, um, by um, Marwin's International. So... You just make sure you get all that off. So it kind of lifts it up. And like, don't worry about it if it gets up there, because that just adds to the kind of definition of your um, of the eyebrow, of the eye, the eyebrow bone. And then I found like you can use that to kind of color in the um, the eyebrows as well, because um, I have very bright eyebrows, so. And then you go back to your brush and you just kind of brush it in, like just shade it in. And, oh, it's a bit out there now. You can fix it. Oh shit. You can fix it up later, like, you know, like just go back over it with the pan stick um, to get rid of any dark bits that might have kind of done their own thing. For lip stuff, um, the, the um, Evening Echo um, moist, lip moisturizer. So then I like to use this um, this no brand uh, for five seventy nine from somewhere, um, and you you just take that for your lip your lipstick then as well. And I like to have a bit of control about with it, so I'm going to put it on the finger there and just put it on. You know what I mean? Like kind of like Miranda's things now. I'm going to just put it on, like because her lips are stunning. And I, I follow her on YouTube and um, I think her makeup is fantastic. And what I do as well, and this is a good trick if you just take note of this, is that if you have a little bit extra of the lipstick, you could actually use that as a rosé kind of um, cheekbone enhancer as well, you know, like as like a, like a blusher. Look, do you know what I mean? You can instantly see. Um, the definition of that there so that kind of locks that in so finally to complete the look I think you just gotta throw the hair over and you pin it in with just one clip now Do you know so like I have a big fringe there so I'm gonna just pin pin the um, fringe back there now my hair's so thick so you, you pin it back like that. So that completes the the kind of face look there now. Um, so then finally, what I do is to kind of lock it all in. Is just spray spray it on the face. Um, hairspray. That locks all the makeup. In. So next, now we're going to go on just really quickly onto the outfit that I'm going to wear and it's an all-in-one outfit as well and it's a really really simple Halloween um, traditional type of outfit so you grab a black uh, a black bag 
downstairs. So, you know, you just give the black egg a shake, shake out like that. Shake out like that, right? So the trick here now is to just make sure you know, be careful with the scissors, be careful. And so you, you put in a space around for the head, for the head like that. Just do a lovely little triangle um, for your arm. So you see you instantly already have the shape of the outfit there. So you just put the arm through like that. Give your body a shape then you just grab a belt, you know. Just tie on a normal belt. So that's it now there. There you have it. Um, the complete and utter um, Halloween um, sexy makeup look. So let me know how you get on with the look. Um, send some likes or send some comments in the section below about how you got on. If you have any questions, just pop me a mail. No bother. Now happy Halloween everybody. Have a laugh. Alright.